Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Isan Tanamasitio, and I'm an English postgraduate student of the Faculty of Cultural Studies, University of Sumatera Utara, Medan. And today, I'm going to introduce and a little bit explain to you about Prat. And what is Prat, actually? Let's check it out. So what is Prat, actually? Prat, spelled P. R double A T means talk is an open software tool for the analysis of speech in phonetics. It was designed and continues to be developed by Paul Borsma and David Winning from the Department of Phonetics of the University of Amsterdam. Paul Borsma and David Winning produce separate editions for this application for Prat for various operating systems such as Microsoft Windows, Mac OS, Solaris, Linux, and etc. All editions function and look alike with the exception of all detail to be precise. The most obvious differences are mainly how they look on the computer system and the individual sign systems they happen to use. It means the electronics and the programs. As you can see on the slide, these are the pictures of Mr. Paul Borsma and Mr. David Winning. Paul Borsma is on the left and David Winning is on the right. Every program or application has a function. So what is actually the functions of this program? So, with Pratt, you can do several things, actually, such as, first, you can generate waveforms, wide and narrowband spectrograms, intensity contour, and pitch tracks. Secondly, you can make recordings, edit the recorded sound, and extract individual sounds for further analysis. The next, you can get information about pitch, intensity, formants, pulses, and etc. The next, you can enhance certain frequency regions, segment and label words, syllables, or individual phonemes. And the last, you can put your work in graphic form or draw a plot for printing. So, you must be wanted to know that what are actually the main features of this program. So, firstly, let's see on the slide as displayed, this is the figure of the menu, main menu of the program. There are three main uh, buttons that you can click. The first is new button. This is where you can create new objects from scratch, such as recording a mono or stereo sound. And then the open button. This is where you can load files or stored on your computer, such as a recording downloaded from the internet or some other Prat specific file you've created. So if you're working with a sound with a longer file, uh, then a couple of minutes it might be better to open it as a long sound file. Don't forget to sound it as a long sound file. And then the save button, this menu, allows you to save files in one of many formats, depending on the kind of Prat object. The Prat program is relatively small and simple to run, actually. It provides some features that allow users to do things. The most common features that people use are namely making a recording, editing sound, measuring manual acoustic, making transcriptions and creating text screens. So, feature number one, making a recording. This is the basic window for recording sound, as you can see on the slide, directly into front. Depending on your operating system, you may see different options, but the general layout is the same. You can change it to a stereo sound if you have a stereo microphone, if you have an external microphone plugged in, you can use that for recording. Otherwise, you can use the one that's built into your computer. 
feature two, editing sound. The picture on the slide shows the main components of the window, taking up the majority of the space are two visualizations, the waveform and the spectrogram. For both of these, the x-axis represents time, so the beginning of the audio is at the far left, and in the end, is far right. The waveform represents the actual sound wave. When the black portion of the waves is taller, it's louder, while the smaller ones, it means the sound are quieter. Feature 3. Measuring Manual Acoustic Prat is designed to do far more than simply viewing and annotating audio recordings. Among the many, many things it can do. Some of them are easily accessible in the sound editor window. So, one can measure three phonetics characteristics on this window. First is pitch, and then intensity, means amplitude, volume, and etc., and formats. It's the frequencies that resonate particularly strongly as a result of the tongue's position in the mouth creating resonating chambers. The next feature, feature 4, making transcriptions. Analyzing an audio by itself is not very productive. For one thing, it is hard to tell where you are in the audio sometimes. In the program, one can make transcriptions. To display the transcriptions, you need to click on the interval menu. When you click on it, it turns yellow until with red breakdowns. The accompanying portion of the audio is also highlighted. Finally, the text is displayed in the editor above the waveform, but below the menu item, as you can see on the slide. It is here that you can edit the text. It is perfectly capable of working with foreign and unusual characters because, as you can see, it's the IPA characters in the tire. The last feature, creating text grids. There are text grids objects that you can display on the program, and to activate it, you need to click on the sound to text grid window. There will be two boxes for input. And in all tire names button, delete the default text on the screen and type phoneme word sentence. This will create three tires, one called phoneme, one called word, and one called sentence. And then hit OK button, and you should see your new text grid object in your product window. So, ladies and gentlemen, from all the explanations, let's conclude things. So, Pratt is the program, is an open software tool for the analysis of speech in phonetics developed by Paul Gorsma and David Winning from Dutch. It functions as to generate waveforms, make recordings, get information about pitch, intensity, and formants, enhance certain frequency regions, and put your work in graphic to draw a plot for printing. And then the features is firstly making recording, editing sound, measuring manual acoustic, making transcriptions, and creating text grids. However, you can of course do all things mentioned above if you have downloaded the Prat programs on your computer. You can get the link and download it from the internet. You just have to search it, type it, and you'll find it and download it. Well then, ladies and gentlemen, that's all about Prat programs. Thank you very much for your very kind attentions. See you again. Have a nice day and... Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.